don't care if the next artist and producer and songwriter over there. Look, lead them over there. I don't care if they're getting 5,000 placements a week. Look, they get 20,000 placements a day. And look, they Instagram, look, filled up with nothing but placements. Could you do me a favor? Look, this episode, we finna focus on you. Look, this episode, we finna focus on your career, your superstardom, and your placements. Because, look, I hear money for you. But you can't hear too good because you're too busy listening for their money. Stop listening for somebody else's money and get out here and hear your own. Okay, let's go. When you talk money, I can hear you. I hear money. What you say now? When you talk money, I can hear you. You ain't got money, that's cold blood. When you talk money, I can hear you. I hear money. Hey, hey, Bubble on Deck. I'm your host, Tamara Bubble. Yeah. Look, aka the I Hear Money Coach. Look, aka your favorite sync superstar. Look, aka we finna mind our business. We finna mind our very own superstardom this episode. Coach, yeah. Look, aka we finna hear money for ourselves. Look, we finna stop listening for other people's money. We Look, if you focus on them, you can't focus on you. Look. If you watching somebody else's pockets, I'm trying to tell you yours is probably empty. Yeah. Anyway, welcome to the show. Can I tell you it's about that time? We finna get right into it. Subscribe time. Thank you for coming. Thank you for listening. All that good stuff. Do me a favor real quick. Let me tell you about subscribe every time. Look, this is a smart podcast. The time on this podcast finna keep on ticking. Can I tell you what you could do while it's tick, tick, ticking away? Yeah. You ain't even got to pause it because it's going to do it while I'm yapping. Do me a favor. Leave me that five-star review like you know what that is. You just got to do that one time per podcast. Not for the, each episode, just one time only. I'm asking for it once. And if you can't give me five stars, I don't need none of them. Can I tell you, I don't need no half a review. Can I get the full five stars because I don't do nothing but bring you gems <laughs> yeah look if you've been here before you already know the types of gems i'm bringing you you should have already left me that five star i shouldn't even have to keep asking you but anyway i'm a coach so i'm gonna coach you along do me a favor leave me that five star review then come back over here do the whole like share subscribe comment youtube you know the youtube stuff the stuff that subscribers do can you hit the bell turn on the notification so you get each and every single future episode yeah then the next thing you could do look when you get done with this episode if this your first time here do me a favor start back at episode one because i'm trying to tell you i'm walking you to superstardom look i'm trying to tell you i'm gonna let you crawl right over there to hear this man yeah i need you to hear it and you're gonna hear it on each and every episode so do me a favor start back look hit the beginning look start back from the beginning and turn on the bell so you don't hear so you don't miss no more do me that anyway after you do me that then you're gonna realize that look i got to tell you about the goals of this podcast i have four goals in mind and i was thinking about you the whole time <laughs> yeah look it rhymes because i'm a rapper but i'm just telling you it rhymes because it's the truth anyway goal number one is to save you money in your sync business goal number two look is to make you more money in music licensing if you still listening can i tell you about goals number three and four yeah goal number three is to transform your mindset this episode is a mindset episode. You finna figure it out. <laughs> yeah. Look, we ain't gonna keep comparing ourselves to other artists. We focusing on our own superstardom this episode. And that's gonna require your mind to look. Can you tell your mind to stop being so nosy? <laughs> anyway, goal number four is to act activate your superstar because look when you saving money with your business when you're making more money in music licensing period look and when your mind is right can i tell you that superstar fit in the act of a yeah if you know like i know then you know superstardom is already within look this podcast is just here to help you activate it look can i introduce you to the sponsor of this podcast the sync superstar academy i'm trying to tell you each and every single resource available with that sponsor is here to help you activate your superstar. Look, there's a challenge out here. It's called the 24-hour Sync Superstar Activation Challenge yeah can i tell you something about that challenge it'll help you look transform your mindset and activate your superstar look here in 30 days or less it's actually gonna do it in a couple of weeks can i tell you something the reason it's called the 24 hour challenge look every day look every 24 hours look a day won't go by i'm trying to tell you when you take that challenge 
each and every single day you finna get some new content look it's on purpose can i tell you habits are created when you practice something when you look when you put effort in something that's how you can create a habit a positive habit you can create a bad habit too but anyway we talking positivity on this one you can create a good habit yeah in about 21 days can i tell you something I'm dropping content in that challenge look, every 24 hours in a cut of weeks. Look. By the time that challenge is over, you're going to have, look, I'm trying to give you the habit of superstardom. I'm trying to give you look, the accountability of a superstar. I'm trying to give you look, the mindset of a superstar. And I'm definitely going to give you the strategy, the resources, and the tools so that you can activate it. I'm trying to tell you I leave no stone unturned. I give all the game away in that challenge. You just don't know. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead and take that challenge when you're ready. Visit SyncSuperstar.com. The link going to be in the show notes, but you know, look, you know, if you know how to spell, you can get there. SyncSuperstar.com. That ain't no hard website to type in. Anyway, I need to get to the disclaimer before we get up into this episode, before we get to comparing stuff, but we get to worrying about other people money when we should be hearing our own. Ew. Anyway, look. Can I tell you something about me? Look, in a look in a former life. No, actually in a look in a current life a couple of years ago. <laughs> yeah. I used to be a licensed CPA. Can I tell you I had a whole degree and stuff and whatnot? And I walked away because I had a whole vision. Look, visions of grandeur with this music business. Can I tell you I love music from head to toe? <laughs> look, from the inside to the out. Look, from my brain to my heart. Me love me some music. <laughs> anyway. I be making money with my music. And I walked away from that accountant. And can I tell you something i didn't forget it though can i tell you i know what i be talking about when i be talking about taxes i know what i be talking about when i be talking about auditing can i tell you i know what i be talking about when i be talking about this look this money that i'm hearing when i'm talking about this legal stuff that i be hearing in this industry when i talk about all the things that i've learned about the music business look some of this advice gonna come off as legal advice some might come off as look tax advice some might come off as business advice look these are just sync gems can i tell you this is free sync game i am not your lawyer i am not your accountant i am not your cpa you need to look you know what they say when something wrong with your mind seek professional help can i tell you this is just free sync game this is just a podcast this is just edutainment look and we fit to go right up into the show and talk about it yeah bubble on that you talk money i hear you i hear money what is that Okay, now, look, this is a quickie, quick episode. Can I tell you? I needed to get up in your head this episode and talk to your mind real quick. Look, can I give you just a couple of phrases, a couple quotes and things that I live by? Look, as a fellow sync superstar, I'm telling you this, it's in your best interest not to worry about what other people do. You got to focus on you. Can I tell you, if you want success in anything, you can't let distractions get in the way. And can I tell you what distractions can be? Look, distractions can be other people's success. Can I tell you, if you're worried about my placements, you ain't focused on getting your own. And that's what, look, that's what I got to tell you. If you want a superstar, you got to mind your business and you got to get to your own placements. You got to get out here and get to hearing your own man. Yeah. Okay, so I'm getting a, look, I'm going to give you a couple of solutions. Look, I got to tell you the problem with it first. Now. I know you heard this phrase. I don't know who said it. So I can't say like, oh, I can't give this person credit because I don't know who made this quote up. But I, I'm going to just tell you, look, it applies. <laughs> yeah, anyway. So shout out to whoever thought of this. But the phrase, I think it goes a little something like comparison is the thief of joy. Look, can I tell you people is out here? Can I tell you people is out here miserable because they're just looking at Instagram too much let it just looking at other people photos look could we step outside of music i'm just talking about people on facebook just watching look people on tiktok people on instagram people on social media look you're supposed to just be on there just to connect and reconnect and look oh i knew you in third grade hey girl you're supposed to be just look keeping up with people but you ain't got to keep up with them Joneses. Can I tell you? You don't need to worry about the vacation folks is going on. You don't need to look. You don't know about their pockets. Can I tell you? Some of these people is renting a lifestyle real quick. So while you out here worrying about, oh my God, they got another car. Oh my God, they got a bigger house. Oh my God, look at that kitchen. That probably ain't their kitchen. Can I tell you? That might be random spoons they eating at their table. Look, that might be look. 
rent a center TV. Slug can they take you. Just because you see it up in their crib don't mean they own it. And look, can I tell you something else? Who cares if they own it? Why is you worrying about they property? Could you mind? your business and get to your money and when i say mind your business it's not the rude mind your business like mind your business no it's like pay attention pay mind pay your mind good could you focus on your business that's how you mind your business you heard the phrase mind the business that pays you could you look could you worry about your catalog could you do, look could you do some admin could you create some more songs today look anytime you find yourself like oogling and look, lusting after other people placements lusting after what they posted lusting after the songs they created that is energy that you could have been focusing on making your hit <laughs> yeah look can i tell you something else look here let me tell you look, even the bible talk about this look in the bible there's 10 commandments can i tell you look commandment number 10 and i don't think this go in any particular order but look commandment number 10 even says thou shall not covet look don't be wanting and worrying about people stop why is you worrying about their stuff can i tell you why you don't need to worry about their stuff i gotta tell you this because look we in the land of superstardom right we on this podcast talking look superstars only if you want to sink or two go ahead and look at other people instagram because you got time to be looking <laughs> again i'll tell you it don't take much effort to get a placement or two we teaching superstardom over here yeah look that take effort that take focus look could you stop worrying about their placements here's why because look here look when we talking superstardom you look you know it and i know it what they say Look, Eric, look, this person got 15 minutes of fame. Look what they say. Oh, this person, look, they see a celebrity out here. They hear the, look, when they hear, when they hear something they don't like, what they say? Oh, this artist, they got 15 minutes of fame and they on number 13. They on number 14. They got 30 seconds left. Look, people just be sitting out here waiting for the person to fail, waiting for their light to dim. Can I tell you something? Even if they light dim, can I tell you, you ain't finna get their spot. If you sitting by watching, if you sitting by lusting, <laughs> look, if you sitting by worrying about what they getting, listening for their money, counting their pockets, watching, look, if you pocket watching, can I tell you, you're not focused on your own career. You're not focused on your own goals, at least not like you should be. Can I tell you, when you focus, look, when you put your head down and you get busy on your career and on your self-development and on your superstardom, can I tell you, you ain't even got time, look, you gonna come up and be looking around like, oh, I didn't know they got married. Oh snap, you got a baby now? Go ahead, girl. Look, I hop up online and don't even be realizing. Oh, oh my God, you got three kids. <laughs> yeah, congratulations. I'll be late with my congratulations. Oh, I done missed your birthday. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, you need to be that focused on you that you don't even know what these folks out here doing. Can I tell you why? <laughs> yeah because even if you sitting by look watching and waiting and praying for their downfall shame on you stop that let me tell you why because a person's fame a person's song a person's career is their own can i tell you their placements are their own can i tell you the songs that they created in the past look the work that they already put in they getting their reward now and can i tell you their time is their time would you let them deal with their 15 minutes maybe they're trying to stretch their minutes out maybe they're trying to extend it to 30 minutes why don't you focus on getting your two minutes why don't you focus on getting your first minute could you focus on getting your shine on your own time because here's the thing look here there's look, there's over 8 billion people in this great big world and can i tell you something even if this artist that you look, even if this producer or songwriter that you've been following and watching and hawking and hoping that they don't win, even if you've been look, praying for their downfall and say they fall, look, say they fall off the earth and they do look, commit a horrible crime and they disappear, that still ain't gonna bring your fans. That still ain't gonna make your song pop. So why is you wishing downfall for them when there's more than enough people out here for both you and them to succeed? If anything, you should be trying to go collab with them. Look, could you, could you, could you stop? Look, I'm trying to tell you, don't compare your, look, don't compare your career. Because you might want what they got and you don't know what they got to deal with. You might want what they got and come to find out it ain't even theirs. They don't even own it. They don't need, look, you don't know what kind of raggedy deals they done signed. Ew. 
I'm trying to say some people get placements and stuff. Some people get deals and things. You be seeing the final product. You be seeing the placement, but you don't know how much money they're getting from that. They might have an awful deal. Now they might have a deal you wouldn't dream of signing. Look here. Look, I don't want that raggedy deal. Could you keep that deal over there? <laughs> yeah, we over here with one stop. <laughs> we over here trying to superstar. Yeah, because when I tell you something, when you superstarring and you indie, <laughs> yeah, look. It don't take much to superstar when you ain't got to give it all away to a label. It don't take much to superstar when you ain't got to give it all to a publisher. Look, it don't take much to superstar when the library ain't snatching it all up. Yeah, there's a reason why I teach superstardom. Because look, the, 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 it might look like the, the tunnel is far away. It might look like your 15 minutes is an eternity away. It might look like it, look, how long is it? Look, it's still skin 30. I still ain't seen no superstar. I still ain't getting no placement. Could you just keep on working? Look, could you just keep on moving? And could you mind your business because they on their own time whatever these other artists is doing let them do let them live let them be great can i tell you <laughs> as long as they ain't stealing your music don't worry about their placements don't worry about their songs don't worry about what they're doing because then you're not focused on yours i'm telling you it's a distraction okay and if you can't hear money that's probably why bubble on deck look if you broke don't talk to me i said if you broke you can't talk to me hey i only hear money